What we're doing is the first time we're going to try actual medical training with the rays. Um, we have been practicing having them swim into our arms. They're very, very social, so they like to swim up, up onto our chest, lift them on our arms, and raise them up to the top water column so that we can bring them over to the side of the pool where the technicians, the medical technicians, can take an ultrasound and scan their backside where their pups are at. So we can start tracking how far along and how developed their pups are. This has been taking place over the last two months. We've tried a number of different things. Thought that maybe in the beginning they would be able to swim up on a raft that would be more comfortable for them. We tried that and they are much more social. So when we tried the raft that kind of spooked them a little bit. Whereas when they would swim up on us and just physically um, bond with us, they were more comfortable so that I would be able to slip my arms underneath them and lift them up and their rostrum comes right up against my chest. They know that I'm there. They'll let me hold them for a good 15 seconds. For most of the part, whenever you ultrasound a, um, a stingray, you have to take it out of the water. You have to put it onto a flat surface. You have to hold the ray down, which is very stressful for the ray. You take a wet towel and you literally hold the ray still. This way, you may sit in your arms while the um, scan is done. It's not stressful to the animal. They don't have to come out of the water. And if this procedure works, we will be able to track the ray's um, gestation period, which right now it is set at nine to 12 months without an exact time of how long the rays are actually um, pregnant. And once these babies are born, we'll be able to track their progress through the next gestation cycle. That worked even better than I thought it was going to. That was awesome. She was really, really good for that. It was exciting. I got really good, clear images for me to go back and review and I'll look at them frame by frame, compare them to images that I've done before and see what I think of, of what is where. But I think I got some, some baby images in there.